True creepy gaming stories? I had a copy of Oblivion on the PS3 that I'm pretty sure was cursed. Anytime you killed something and then moved so it was out of your line of sight then looked back at it, it would be T posing at you. They wouldn't move to follow you, they would just turn in your direction every time you broke line of sight. And once they were T posed, they were stuck that way. You could hit them, grab and drag them, whatever. They would just stay stuck. Some of the weirdest stuff I've ever seen in a game. Must have been about 1998. Pokemon RB wasn't yet released in the UK, but my friends gave me a USR ROM on a floppy disk. I was making my way through Pokemon Tower in Lavender Town. I know it's cliche, but the huge fan lore about that place didn't exist at that time. Got a wild Pokemon encounter in the tower, and after the alert jingle and the screen wipe, the battle didn't load and the entire screen went blood red for about five seconds. Resumed a normal battle with a haunter afterwards. At first I wondered if it was an actual real ghost. This happened around 98 99ths, back when you could still get demo discs from official PlayStation magazine. Me and my friend were in my room, and just going through the demos, well one of them was the terrible looking Rugrats PS1 game, so we decided to play it. As soon as it starts, the sound is messed up. It was very low, and if you turned it up then all you could hear was the sound of the speakers, and everything was muffled, so we turned the volume back down and started playing. A few random parts of the demo did have sound. Random sound effects or a piece of music would play for just a second, and we would jump. But we mostly just thought something was wrong with the demo, or my super old tube TV was about to die. My mom then called us and we both had to go to the other side of the house for maybe two, three minutes. When we got back the TV was off and I knew it had just burnt up. But then my friend noticed that it was unplugged. There was no one else in the house except my sister, but she was with my mom the whole time. And we both found it freaky that the TV had somehow become unplugged while we were gone, since it was under a desk that was beside my TV stand and well out of the way. Once we plugged it back in, we noticed the PlayStation was also off, but not unplugged. We powered it back on, and the sound worked just fine. We went to check the Rugrats demo and no picture, just nothing but muffled sound if we turned the volume up, but just a black screen. No disc red errors would ever pop up, and we would have to hit the restart button to do anything. It may not be creepy to others, but it has bothered me for years as to what happened when we left the room.